Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to Petite Cavi. Guinea pigs are wonderful pets, especially when they are well tamed. Being prey animals, guinea pigs often have a hard time developing a trusting relationship with their parents. So in today's video, I'll share 5 tips with you to help you build that trusting relationship and help tame them. So let's go! Spending time with your fur babies is the best way to allow them to get familiar with you, trust you, and ultimately tame them. Don't hesitate to talk to them, hug them, and cuddle them. This will not only allow your guinea pig to get to know you and recognize you, they will learn that you are not there to threaten them, but rather feed them, love them, and care for them. Food, whether for humans or animals, is the key to anyone's heart. Food is therefore one of the key components in winning the heart and trust of your guinea pig. Don't hesitate to feed them a handful of fresh hay whenever you walk over or give them some delicious vegetables to chew on. Giving them food whenever you're around will allow them to associate you in a positive way and help them overcome their natural fear of prey. Being naturally nervous little animals, guinea pigs like to know what to expect. If they were humans, they would definitely be type A. Establishing a daily routine with your little pets will allow them to associate certain times of the day with certain activities. For instance, my guinea pig's morning vegetable meal coincides with their daily cage cleaning. They have therefore come to expect and predict that morning breakfast for them is morning cleanup for mommy. Therefore, my fur babies are now extremely happy and have no problem getting into their taco taxi to come eat breakfast, and that gives me the time I need to clean the cage. When guinea pigs know what to expect, they will generally be more relaxed and trusting, leading to more tame guinea pigs. Guinea pigs need an environment where they feel safe and calm. I would recommend when choosing their home location to avoid a place where there are often loud and sudden noises. Not only will they get startled, but they have very sensitive hearing, so loud noises are often amplified. Make sure to choose a place for their cage that is generally quiet, around where the family typically spends lots of time, and also make sure their home has lots of hiding spots, so they can seek refuge when needed. A guinea pig will be a lot more receptive and tamed in an environment where they can feel safe and where they can seek safety when they feel needed. It's important to remember that even though these little animals are cute and soft, we need to be gentle with them. They are naturally prey animals, so each time we go to pick them up, they get a little stressed. Avoid if possible any sudden movements, shadows, or surprising them by either grabbing them from above or without them seeing you first. This can remind them of predators and they will get scared, rather than excited to be loved by their favorite humans. If possible, avoid leaning over your guinea pig and try to move around quietly. Letting them know you are there by talking to them will also help them know what's going on and that there's someone nearby. The time it takes to tame your guinea pig varies a lot from guinea pig to guinea pig. Each guinea pig has a different personality and a different background. 
Usually, it takes a few weeks to bond with a fairly confident guinea pig, while for a very shy young guinea pig, it can take a lot longer for them to build that bond and trust you. The personality of your guinea pig also plays a big role in the time it takes for them to trust you and therefore for you to tame them. A naturally extroverted and curious guinea pig will tame much faster than a guinea pig who is very calm and cautious by nature. It's already over. Feel free to share your experience with the video in the comments and see you soon for another one. Bye!